<clears throat> okay, so I've got a question from a student here, and I've cut and pasted it up in the top of the screen. Can you see it? It says, let me come here in black, it says, if 100 mils of a 0.4 molar solution of sodium sulfate, so let me start there. First of all, there's a misprint here. Sulfate it's got a 2 minus and sodium's got a, a, a 1, so there must be a 2 right there. This is sodium sulfate. Um, what I'm going to do before I even start, um, I, see a, I see I've got a volume and a concentration. Before I even start reading the question, I'm going to write sodium sulfate and my volume, concentration. And the reason I'm going to do that is because we're almost always going straight to moles, right? And I know that, watch this. Um, concentration is equal to, watch this, moles per liter, right? Or molarity is equal to moles of solute, big, big deal here, solute per liter of what? Solution, right? Okay. So this is always in the back of my mind, and I admit, I don't forget that. That I've got memorized, and I've used it in practice enough that when I see something like this, I just immediately go to, I see volume, and I see concentration, and I'm going to go, you know what, before I get any further, I'm going to calculate moles. So this volume, and I'm going to do it in liters, is 100 mils, which is 0 0.1 liters, right? Okay. And then it's 0.4 molar. Point Four molar, which gives me 0.04 moles, right? Three sig figs in both of these, okay? So all I've done so far is just read like the first five words, but made some notes to myself. Okay, and it's, it's now added to, all right, 200 mils of something else. What's this, sodium chloride? Okay, sodium chloride, watch this now, 200 mils, which is 0.2 liters, and it's 0.6 molar, 0.6, okay, so this goes to 0.12 moles, oops, I uh, just made it, three sig figs, okay, 0 0.120 moles, and I, you know, consider putting that in your calculator, that I did in my head, but I'm sure it's right. All right, of sodium chloride. What is the concentration of sodium ions? Aha, okay, so I'm gonna do, let me come over here, change my colors, and say this is sodium ions. Well, I'm getting sodium ions from two different places, right? There's some here and some here. So I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna call this solution A and this solution B. I'm gonna say sodium ions from solution A and sodium ions from solution B. Now, obviously, once they hit the water, they don't know the difference, but where they're coming from, right? So, I'm going to say if there's this many moles, i got to find the moles here, right? This many moles of sodium sulfate, how many moles of sodium ions are there from that? Well, there's two for every one. Right? There's two sodium ions for every one mole of that. So I've got 0 0.04 moles of sodium sulfate, which is just right there. But there's two to one. Right? Can you, can you see that? There's two of them. So this is going to be 0 0.08. Right? Okay, so let's do the same thing with the other one. You know, I can see that's one to one. So I'm not even going to do a conversion. Can you see there's only one? I can see there it's one to one, so this is going to be 0 0.12, right? And so it looks like I'm going to do, I've, I haven't left myself enough room here. Total, it's 0 0.2. And I'm guessing it's three sig figs here. Now, if I'm adding those, it's 
not. Yeah, it is. It goes to that, right? Go back to there. Okay, can you see that? This plus this is equal to this, okay? And because you've got a bunch of sodium ions, so here's what you've got coming in. Sodium. Those are pluses, right? You've got a bunch of those guys coming in. And you've got a bunch of sodium chlorides coming in too, right? And the question is, if I add one mole of sodium sulfate to one mole of sodium chloride, I have three moles of, of, sulfide, of, of sodiums, right? One, two, three. So that's what I'm doing here. I'm adding them. I'm, I'm considering the two um, compounds separately, finding how many sodium ions each has. Then I'm adding them together, right? Now what's the total volume? Because it says, assume the volumes are additive. What's the total volume? It looks like it's 0.3 liters. 0 0.300 0, 0 liters, because I add these two up, right? Agreed? OK. Got a bucket of this. There's my A. There's my B. Am I add them together? Well, of course. When I pour them together, these two volumes are additive. All right. so. I was asked what's the concentration of sodium ions, and that's what I've got here. So all I've got to do is calculate that. And remember, concentration is equal to moles per volume. Concentration is equal to moles, which is 0 0.200 per volume, 0 0.300, which comes out to be 2 thirds. Can you see that? Uh, 0 0.667 molar. And there's my answer. OK, Nastasia. Hope you like it. Let me know.